Hey everybody, in this video I wanted to share an awesome update that Printify just released for your color option mockups on apparel products. All right, so this is a brand new update from Printify that I just noticed in my account last week. It's not available for all apparel products yet, but Printify indicated that it is planned to come out for additional products. I'll link to the help page that details this update in the description. We're gonna use the Bella Canvas 3001 for this example because I know this feature is already there for this product. So if we go to the preview view, I haven't even uploaded a design yet for this particular product, but if we go from the editor view over to the preview view, you'll see what I'm talking about here. There's actually a little pop-up in the bottom right corner, kind of behind my head-ish, alerting you to this new feature. All right, I'll get rid of myself for a second there so you can hopefully see better. In the bottom right corner is where you'll find this new feature under the mock-up background section. The great thing about this feature is that instead of giving you preset or predetermined images or colors, Printify is giving us the ability to add our own image. That means you can brand it, you can have it look any way that you want. Notice here that they're recommending a resolution of 2048 by 2048 pixels. And so that's the size that we're gonna go create. So let's just hop over to Canva. We've created a new project in that exact resolution, 2048 by 2048. I'm just gonna come over to the left. I'm gonna go to the photo section. I like to use wood background, so I just search for wood. I'm just gonna take this first one that I see here, just for the example, so we can move things along. So we'll fill out the background with our wood, and then I'm gonna go ahead and add my logo to the corner. Now I wanna make sure to place it in a location where it's not gonna overlap with the mock-up. So there we go, let me just make this small enough that it looks like it won't overlap with any part of the mock-up. There we go, got my logo in the corner. You could certainly add a little text around to the bottom or the top or the side if you wanted to, just make sure it doesn't overlap or go behind the actual product mock-up. So if you wanted to add your shop name or something like that, in text in the corner as well, you could certainly do that. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and download this. Either JPEG or PNG should be fine for this. Just make sure you've got the resolution that Printify recommends. Then we can come back over here to Printify and just click on Add Image and we'll upload what we downloaded. And there we go. As you can see, the logo in the corner is not overlapping or going behind the mock-up, so we're good to go there. If we needed to make any adjustments, we could simply just remove this and then re-upload it, but this is looking good to me. And now you can actually switch between the colors of your product also, because sometimes you might have picked a background color that doesn't look great with some of the lighter colored apparel, especially like a white t-shirt. Like, here's a good example. I probably would decide not to use this painted white wood background because with the white t-shirt, it's kind of hard to see the t-shirt. But if you were only selling darker colors, a light colored background like this is certainly usable. And that's really it. The entire design process and the publishing process is exactly the same other than uploading your own mock-up background here. Now, when I publish this to my Etsy shop, these mock-ups will come through with this background already there no downloading it, manually editing it, re-uploading it. None of that manual work now that Printify gave us this option. Now, of course, for your listings, I do still recommend you go and get at least a couple of high quality mockups to use for your primary thumbnail and at least a couple other ones. These really are just good options to use to demonstrate what the color options are and show your design on the different color options that you offer. I wouldn't recommend using these as your primary or your only mockups. Let me know what you think. Are you going to use this new feature that Printify offered? Let me know in the comments below. I hope you found this helpful. Do me a favor, hit the like button if you did find it helpful and subscribe to the POD Insights channel if you haven't already. Thank you to all subscribers. I really do appreciate your support. Thanks everybody. See you next time. Mm -hmm.